Hello friends, welcome to functions of complex variable. Before defining functions of complex variable, I want to discuss about the equation modulus of z minus a is equal to r. Here a is a complex number, r is a real number. Okay, now I want to draw the diagram of this equation. I can say that geometrically this equation represents a circle or I can say that locus of a point satisfying this condition with radius r around a. What it means? It means that I can draw the real and imaginary axis. So this is x axis and y axis or I can say that a real axis imaginary axis. So this equation represents a circle like this with center A and radius R. Right? So I can say that the equation of this circle is mod of Z minus A is equal to R. So it is a general equation. Now I want to consider some uh, particular examples. So for example, if the given equation is like this, mod of Z minus 2 minus 3i is equal to 2. The same equation can be written as mod of z minus sin is outside 2 plus 3i is equal to 2. So I can note down these numbers or I can compare this equation with the previous equation z minus a is equal to r small a is equal to 2 plus 3i. It is a complex number or is a real number. Now I want to note down 2 on the real axis, 3i on the imaginary axis, I hope you will get a point 2,3. I want to draw circle about this point with the radius 2. Approximately, I can draw a circle like this with a radius r or in particular 2 with 2,3. Is it clear? The equation of this circle is z minus 2 plus 3i is equal to 2. Is it clear? Or you can consider an one more equation mod of z minus 3 minus 0 into i is equal to 2. Is it clear? Here uh, I want to note down the center. Center is on real axis because imaginary axis is 0. Is it clear? So now I can draw a circle about 3 with the radius 2. Is it clear? Or you may consider an another example z minus 0 plus 4i is equal to 3. Center is 4i. Is it clear? Draw a circle about 4i. I hope you will get a circle with radius 3 center is 0 comma 4 or you can consider an another example z minus minus 4 plus 0 i is equal to 2 i hope you will get a minus 4 with radius 2 draw a circle with radius 2 4 is the center or you can consider z minus 0 minus 3i. So minus 3i is the center with the radius 2. Does it clear? Radius 2. Right? So like that you can consider various values for a and r. a means small a. Small a means a complex number. r means a real value. You can draw a circle. Suppose if a is equal to 0, then I can obtain mod of z is equal to r. Geometrically what it represents, 
it is also represents a circle right with radius r center zero now i can ask what is the polar form of this equation polar form of this equation can be written as z is equal to r into e to the power i theta r r into cos theta plus i sin theta is it clear geometrically what it represents it represents a circle only right with radius r what about theta right so i can obtain z is equal to r when theta is equal to 0 what is the value of z is equal to i into r when theta is equal to 5 by 2 z is equal to minus r when theta is equal to pi so z is equal to minus i r when theta is equal to 3 pi by 2 z is equal to r again when theta is equal to 2 pi it means you can obtain the theta x axis and y axis you can obtain the theta in this way you can complete one a rotation is it clear with the origin r is the radius right so now i want to know what is the point on the circle in case of a polar form right so when a is not equal to 0 z is equal to a plus r into e raised to i theta is the point on the circle right so now i can take a one uh, similar type of uh, example say mod of z minus 3 plus 7 i is equal to 4 right so what is the diagram of this equation so draw real and imaginary axis note down 3 and say for example this is minus 7 i these two lines will coincide at here yeah, this becomes the center so you can draw a circle with a radius 4 so like that you can consider a general equation z minus a means mod of z minus a is equal to r you can take a is equal to some complex number or can be replaced by some real number then you can draw a circle right thank you